Hello everybody, it is Samurai here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how I farm coal. I will be showing the comparison of with Monster Musk versus without because I know not everybody has access to it depending on what point of the game you're in. And I do want to also preface this with I don't like buying materials. It's something that can really sap the joy out of st Stardew for me, and unfortunately it does make a lot more work for me and it takes a lot more time but in my opinion, it's worth it. If you're also like this, then this video is probably for you and I hope it's helpful. Now, unfortunately, I was kind of silly and I didn't check the luck for each of the days, so I have no idea what the luck was. I went around the same time each day. On the day without Monster Musk, I went around 20 minutes earlier than with it. Now I will also say that I have gotten the burglar's ring already. You can get this by slaying 500 dust sprites and then talking to Gil to collect the reward from the Adventures Guild. This raises the chance of them dropping coal from 50% to a 75%. This is going to make a huge impact, so you will see a drastic difference most likely if you do not have the ring. It will overall still be a very good method though. Now, I also didn't get very lucky right off the bat with dust sprites. I did get quite a bit of iron, which is good because I have some big plans in the process which need a lot of iron, so I'll take all I can get. I did end up getting an infested floor, which was super helpful in upping the amount of coal I got. In the end, I only got 38 coal, which really is not great until you consider how little time I spent in the mines being only a few hours. For the dive with Monster Musk, which I did the next day, you can see the changes immediately. There are a lot more mobs across the board and this makes the process seem a lot more, less tedious because you get higher rewards quicker. Monster Musk is generally a late game item. In order to get the crafting recipe for it, you must complete the Wizard's Prismatic Jelly Quest. This will only show up on the special orders board outside of Mayor Lewis's house. And this is only there once it's fallen near one. Crafting recipe is relatively simple. All you need is 30 slime and 30 bat wings. Although it may seem like a hassle to get at first, it can be incredibly useful. At the end of the dive with Monster Musk, I got 106 coal, which is a huge improvement compared to without it. Granted, the results will vary depending on the luck of the day. If you are in need for a lot of coal, you should look for the lowest luck day possible. This will increase the chance of infested floors and also increase the number of mobs in general. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions or would like me to do one comparing the different lucks, let me know in the comments below. And as always, if you liked it, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe. Make sure to stay lovely and have a great day.